So I want to talk about today why I'm up uh, drive by way of Dotto to the Haltech VDC. No, I'm not actually going to do it on the car. I'm just going to do pretty much show anyone who wants to do this so they can do it. Uh, Alright, so for this I'll be using a BMW pedal. Now, yes, it's dirty. It's... But this is one of the cheapest pedals you can get for a drive by wire setup, and you can do this for any car if you're running an aftermarket ECU. And you can get this at any junkyard. I'm not sure how much you're gonna charge for it, but they're pretty common. Now, this is a six pin plug that plugs into this pedal position. And it has two pedal position sensors, two five volts, and then two signal grounds. And that's all it is. All right, so the colors for these might vary from car to car, but on this one, which was from an E46, the two brown wires are the two grounds. And for wiring purposes, you just wire these together to your signal ground distribution block. The two yellow wires are the 5 volts supply, sensor supply, and for the same, you can wire these two together to your power supply block, and then these two you're going to wire individually because they're pe pedal position 1 and pedal position 2, and those will go straight to the ECU. So these two, go signal ground, 5 volt supply, sensor, sensor uh, would be input into the ECU, two separate inputs. Now here I have two throttle bodies. This is from uh, 330i. And this is from a M62 engine. Uh, pretty sure, I'm not sure about the car that I took it from, but it was an M62 engine. All right, now, they both all BMW and Mini, and Mini um, drive by wire throttles use this plug here it's also a six pin plug and if you look back here you can see where this one is actually a five volt supply and this is a signal ground so the five volt supply is pin two and the signal ground is pin six and you can see it kind of imprinted on the back here now these two are your throttle position sensors so one and two and then these two actually goes it powers the motor that are in the throttle bodies and it causes it to open and close right so now with your purchase of any Haltech elite ecu it comes with a wiring diagram and it will tell you how to wire a generic drive by wire with throttle so yeah now Pin 6 on the throttle plug is ground and literally you can join all these three grounds. They go to the same place. Just like how this is 5 volt power supply, you can join them with the yellow because they're going the same place. And there is specified outputs from the Haltec Elite ECU that supplies both the 5 volt and the signal ground. Now, these two are the motor no, these two are the throttle position sensors one and two, and this is motor one and two, and their designated locations are listed in the Haltech Elite ECU wire diagram. All right. Now here you can see the wiring information from the Haltech Elite wiring diagrams, and this is for the 2500 Elite ECU, as that's what I'm running in my car. So for TPS one and TPS two. It will literally be the throttle position and that's pin one and pin four on the throttle plug for the bmw throttle body and for app1 and app2 that's actual pedal position and that is the pedal sensor that is pin four and pin six on the plug for the pedal unit and motor one and motor two is pin three and pin six which is on the throttle position plug as well and it's that simple to wire and all the grounds and all the 5 volt supply will go to one place which is from your 
the power and ground distribution box.